Hey everyone, this is Liza Soberano, and in celebration of my upcoming movie, Lisa Frankenstein, that's coming out this February 7th, I thought I would share with you a few of the keepsakes that I have with me that I got from filming Lisa Frankenstein back in 2022. So, to kickstart this video, we've got this hat. So it's a Lisa Frankenstein hat that the director, Zelda herself, had made for all the cast and crew. And I thought it was so cute that she really personalized each and every hat. So we all have our names on it. And I'm really excited to like go around LA and wear this hat. I think it's a really great way to like subtly promote your movie. Next up, we have this backrest. Actually in Hollywood, it is normal for them to create customized backrests for the director's chairs for cast, the director, and crew. It's also tradition for them to keep the backrests after filming. Catherine wanted to make it extra special for us, so on the last day of our filming, while we were waiting for the final setup, she took some paint and started painting all over our backrests, and she painted this herself, and it's so lovely and sweet. I love it. Okay, next. I have this mug and unfortunately it broke on my way back here to the Philippines after filming. I was so sad about that. Like I had planned it out. I wasn't going to use it because I didn't want to ruin it because it's so special to me. So this mug came from Catherine and this was her kind of last day gift to me, Zelda, Cole, and Henry. I didn't know that she had a talent for drawing, but right here you can see Cole, Creature, and Catherine as Lisa. And then we have our director Zelda right here. And then I'm over here in my little cheerleader costume with Henry over here. I never thought of this myself. It's It has such a personal touch to it and it just made me feel like she loved and appreciated me so much. So I got so killig when she gave this to me. I treasure this mug so much even though it's broken. I'll try to glue it back together someday. Next, it's actually a whiskey glass that I got from the producer of our film. His name is Jeffrey. And it's really cute because he put a little Frankenstein sticker on it. And he said, thank you from Jeffrey. And I've been keeping it covered because I just don't want to damage any of my keepsakes from the film. This is a whiskey glass that he got me with the Lisa Frankenstein logo. I don't know if I'm ever going to use it. I will probably put it in my collection of cups and mugs case. This one I got very excited about. So this was given to me by the props department. Um, and I never actually get to wear it in any of the scene, scenes in the film, but you'll see it a lot in the background of certain scenes. And I would like to assume that this is Taffy's prom queen crown. Um, but I did get to wear it for some of the prop photos. So you'll see me wearing it in like the background photos and everything. But yeah, I'm really happy about this. I'll put this down right here. And last but not least, this is my favorite keepsake out of all of them because it's something that I actually had to wear every single day when filming. It's this watch um, and I love how like unique looking it is. It's like jelly in texture and it has like a pink like little watermelon face or dial or whatever you call it. And it's just, it reminds me of the 80s so much and it reminds me of Taffy so much because I literally had to wear it every day for filming. And it actually works so I can use it if I want to. Um, but I'm just gonna keep it and preserve it the way it is. And so yeah, these are all the keepsakes that I kept from filming Lisa Frankenstein. I actually have more. So I had a gift that I got from Diablo Cody. She gave it to me on my first day of filming. It had um, a personalized note that she made for me just congratulating me and thanking me for being part of the project. But she also gave me some Laffy Taffy, which um, she drew inspiration from for my character's name. And she gave me a candle because she knew that I was really into like wellness and candles and everything. Unfortunately, I ate the Laffy Taffy and the candle has been used. So it's not here with me today, but thank you so much Diablo for giving me a little gift as well. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please don't forget to watch Lisa Frankenstein coming out in theaters nationwide this February 7th. Thank you guys so much for the love and support.